An end-fed half-wave antenna is a popular choice among ham radio enthusiasts for its simplicity and effectiveness. This type of antenna is a long wire antenna that is fed at one end, as opposed to the more traditional center-fed dipole antenna. The end-fed half-wave antenna is typically a half-wavelength long, making it resonant on one specific frequency. One of the main advantages of an end-fed half-wave antenna is its versatility. It can be installed in a variety of configurations, such as sloping, vertical, or horizontal, depending on the available space and desired radiation pattern. This flexibility makes it an ideal option for amateurs with limited space for antenna installations. Another advantage of the end-fed half-wave antenna is its efficiency. Due to its length and resonant design, it can produce good signal strength and radiation patterns, making it an effective option for ham radio operators looking to communicate over long distances. However, there are some considerations to keep in mind when using an end-fed half-wave antenna. One potential issue is the high impedance at the feed point, which can result in a mismatch with the radio equipment. To address this, a matching network or antenna tuner may be needed to ensure maximum power transfer between the antenna and the radio. Additionally, end-fed antennas are more prone to picking up noise and interference from nearby electronic devices, power lines, and other sources. Careful placement and proper grounding can help minimize these issues and optimize the performance of the antenna. In conclusion, the end-fed half-wave antenna is a popular choice for ham radio operators due to its simplicity, effectiveness, and versatility. By understanding its characteristics and potential challenges, hams can make the most of this antenna type for their communication needs.